Lucy and today we are back with another video today we are building Stonehenge in Minecraft and I hope you enjoy it this is gonna be quite fun and I'm just watching it now just to see there we go I'm gonna look up some Stonehenge facts found on England Salisbury Plain in White and Wiltshire Stonehenge is a a huge man-made circle of standing stones built by our ancestors over many hundreds of years ago. It's one of the world's most famous prehistoric monuments and one of the and it's one of its biggest mysteries too. Work started on the superstone circle around 5000 years ago in the late Neolithic age. It took over a thousand years to build in four long stages. Archaeologists believe that the final change was made around 1500 BC in the early Bronze Age. If you visit Stonehenge today, you'll see stones still standing in a circular arrangement. Archaeologists, archaeological research shows that the structure of this amazing monument changed over time as it was built and rebuilt by generations of ancient people. Well, thousand years ago, Stonehenge is made up out of 30 standing stones called sarsens, which surrounded five huge stones, arches, in a, horse, in a horseshoe shape. There were also two circles made of smaller blue stones, one inside of in the outer circle and one inside the horseshoe. As well as four station stones positioned outside a central monument. The entire site was surrounded by a circular ditch. It's the question that people have baffled for centuries, and even today, no theory has been proven. How could people thousands? of years ago transported and arranged its colossal stones. A legend from the 12th century giants placed a monument on a, on a mountain in Ireland before a wizard named Morgan magically moved the stone circle to England. It's a shame they didn't really have a wizard to help them, they could have done that with the help. The lighter blue stones weigh about 3,600 kilograms each. That's the same as two, as two cars. Our bigger sarsen stones weigh a big whopping 22 tons. That's as heavy as four African elephants. Archaeologists believe that the sarsen stones were built on a huge site on big wooden sledges for 32 kilometers away. But the blue stones have been tractor rock outcrops 250 kilometers 225 kilometers away in wheels it's thought they could have been dragged on sledges to a waterway and then floated on rafts to the building site shaping the stones would have required hundreds of hours of hard graft with some hammers and some chisels but how would a ginormous shape oh is it what am i reading yeah i lost ginormous balls listed to their standing position but i thought that first the builders dug deep ditch ditches for the base of the boulders they use they then use ropes and strong wooden poles and frame raise and frames to raise them and them up before picking the ditches with rocks and rubble to hold them in place and the viola job done and the large job done. Oh yeah and I just quickly need to have a look at my stone hinge. It's doing pretty well. Yeah, I'm just building all the cobblestones in there. Um, so yeah. It is quite a good video. Yeah, there go my cobblestones. Yeah, it's pretty good. 
put some over here, put some over there, put some wherever I can. Yeah. We put all the cobblestones everywhere. So yeah, that's my stone hedge. And I hope you enjoyed it. So, bye.